Continuing on with the Mario Galaxy walkthrough, we are going off to Battle Rock Galaxy! I love the music in this place, by the way. Then again, as I said before, I love the music throughout this entire game. This is Battle Rock Barrage! Yeah. Okay, stop being hyper, PK Gam. No, it's in your blood. You must be hyper. So, yeah, this is the Battle Rock Barrage. There's going to be exploding things all over the place, probably. And the first thing that you're going to be wanting to do is making yourself some blue... Or whatever you want to call it. Uh, uh, I can't think of the name. Pulse or Grab Stars, Hold Stars, whatever you want. Pull Stars, that's it. Ah, why do I always misphrase things when I'm on camera? I don't know. Uh, oh, shoot, don't hit me. By the way, these things don't hurt you at all, but they can push you off ledges and stuff like that. If there's a ledge that uh, they can push you off, I'm just saying there, just uh, for your own uh, information there. And the last one is right here. It's going to orbit around just this very edge here. And there is our pole stars. Yes, I got it right this time. Just grab out to one, grab out to the other. Shake the Weaver mode, and you'll be slinged all over to the next area. And now you have to go off, off to this other side. Jump on this springy guy over here, and you'll appear on this other planet. Now, uh, do a spin on this screw. Yes, this is a screw. Yeah, if you can't tell, I'll just do a little... Uh, I can't I can't zoom into the camera. I mean, I can't go into first-person perspective. Um, you move the Wii Remote around on that wall there, you'll get a ton of star bits that are attached to the wall there. I don't know why those star bits are attached to the wall, but hey, they're there. You can grab them. Oh, there's another one. Yeah, I've already got 39 star bits, and I've only been playing this thing for like three minutes or so. Actually, it's almost been two minutes. Wow, that's quick. Um, and yeah, you can walk all the way up, uh, all on all directions on this thing, and you have to to avoid the obstacles on this thing. Um, this obstacle right here isn't hard at all um, to avoid. You know, all these like laser things here. And if you hit that question mark thing, you'll make stars appear out of those cannons. So I guess those cannons are now firing star bits. I don't know. Don't question the video game logic. And even if you grab the front one that's making other ones form. It will also, it won't stop the other ones from forming, so again, don't question the game logic. I, I'm just saying that, you know, just, just for your, just to be insightful, you know, I'm, I'm not questioning it myself. I don't want the universe to implode. I mean, come on, we're in space, for God's sakes. Um, and you, as you can see, there's a star here. Um, so how do we get that star? I don't see anything to make it explode. But wait a second, wait a second. Bullet bills, bullet bills. You can use these bullet bills to open up these uh, glass containers here, or cage containers, whatever you want to call them. And uh, I would highly recommend that you do so. Just long jump over to this one here. Make sure that that one doesn't hit an enemy or hit the wall. Uh, um, I should say that little nub in the center, these UFOs or any other things. And then you'll be able to easily break apart the star. Woo! Well, that was a pretty dang quick star, so let's just go right to the next one. This is Breaking Into the Battle Rock! Okay, that was way too epic for your own good. <laughs> uh, the first part, you're going to be starting off on these weird UFO platforms just like before. Uh, only this time, you're going to have to break apart your sling star. To do that, you have to go grab one of these bob bombs here and jump across the UFOs and then just throw it across from this UFO to the other one. And that'll break apart that star without any trouble whatsoever. I should say break apart that sling star. And you can also break apart this one, of course, to get some star bits. And I will, because I'm a greedy SOB there. And kablooey! Give me star bits! Yeah! And okay, then we go to the next planet, which is this really weird four ball attached to each other colored one. Whatever you want to call it. Oh, oh no! Um, here's another secret star. You'll have to feed this critter later. I'm just saying, you, you'll have to do that later. Um, I'm looking for a bob -omb. There we go. And now I have to go throw it at that cage over there. Who would have guessed? Uh, just like so, and that'll blow apart that cage. But I'm going to go grab another one, because you can get a ton of star bits off this planet. Just watch this here. Uh, break apart this cage right here. Yep, did you see it? It's a rainbow star. Oh shoot, I hope that blows up the cage. 
Yeah, it also blew, up, blew apart that chomp. And that, of course, makes me invisible, which means I can blow apart these chomps all to my heart's content and get a ton of star bits for it. Look at me go! Woo! Yeah, baby, that is pure greed in a nutshell right there, baby. <laughs> As I said, I, I like to collect a lot of star bits along the way. It's just how I play, it's just how I have fun and sling back into this star. Grab all the star bits you can along this way. I'm, oh, I guess there's no star bits to collect along there. Okay, here's this is where we start to get some obstacles on these uh, these star paths here. Uh, as you can see, um, there's there's these mines here. If you touch one of these mines, you guess that they blow up and you fall. Um, sometimes you fall to your death. Sometimes you fall all the way to that beginning point, whatever you want to call it. Um, I don't know what determines it, but I don't want to try it and find out. So just get yourself over to that sling star there, collect us all the star that you can along this outer perimeter here. And the next thing you want to do is triple jump your way up here if you can, or double jump, whatever. And uh, hit that thing. Yeah, star bits! Woo! And <laughs> go, go into this pipe here. And you'll end up with this weird thing here. There's a Luma trapped inside a crystal. Um, you can't do anything about that until you break apart this cage, so there's a bob on right there. Just spin to stun him, and throw a bob on up to that cage. And you can also, if you want to, get some coins from those yellow things out on the wall there. But I'm sure that's unnecessary there, so just fall right into that uh, cannon there. And try and shoot yourself so you hit both the center one, the center crystal, and the outer crystal. Otherwise, you're going to have to do this twice, but I think you're going to have to do it anyway twice. Because once you break it apart, uh, you'll have to uh, shoot yourself back up there anyway. Um, otherwise, if you miss, you're going to have to open up this cannon here and carefully aim. Aim, aim, whoops. Aim for where that thing is going, not for uh, where it's currently at. There we go. Get ready to shake the Wii Remote. Shake the Wii Remote right here. Shake, 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 shake. There we go. Speed run tactics. And the whole ship blows up. And now we go to the next area, which appears to be some sort of oval-shaped rocket ship, whatever you want to call it. And grab one of these things right here. Um, you can get a two-for-one deal right here at McDonald's. Oh, shoot, I didn't mean to do that. Um, by grabbing this and uh, throwing it... Whoops. You want to blow up both the one-up... Ah, shoot, what's wrong with me? You want to blow up both the one-up mushroom cage and the... Um, uh, cage that houses the star. Uh, what's wrong with me? Dang it! Go away, star. I mean, go away, Bob. Um, you want to blow up the one-up cage and the cage that's holding the um sling star at the end at the same time, if you can. Um, if not, just don't worry about it. Uh, throw it like right over there. It should blow them both up. There we go. That's an easy way to get uh, both the one up and the cannon at the same time without having to go back twice. And all you have to do is aim for the star here. Boink! Do not hit one of those things! Oh shoot! Oh, that's okay. Uh, wait, maybe it's not okay. Oh, I just fell back over here. Oh, that's okay. That's the first time I ever did that, actually. Of course, the one time I... Oh, the second time I fail at it is on camera. Of course it is! Yeah, you're supposed to time yourself to uh, shoot at the star here. This should be just fine right now. Yeah! And the victor goes a star.